Here's a Bakelite cabinet that I'm going to put a little stain on because it's faded a little bit. And here's the back. Let me turn this over and you can see that it should be a little darker and a little bit shinier. Now this might shine up with polish all right uh, and probably will. But uh, a YouTuber wanted to know why my Bakelite radios look so well. Well, I came up with this idea because one of my radios that I got, this was very, very faded. And I just didn't want to remove all that material. So I thought, let's try a stain on this. I'm using very, very little amount of stain here, and we'll just rub it on like that. It's looking pretty good. This is a very, very small amount. Matter of fact, just from the lid. Okay. Now the color that you'd use Depends on the Bakelite. Okay. That's getting pretty good. This one happens to be, let's see, English Chestnut. So I'm going to continue with the rest of the cabinet. We'll take a look at it when we're done. Now it's the next day and I have wiped off the excess stain and it's looking really good. Everything is the same color and there's no hint of uh, any fading on the top anymore. The whole thing looks the same. Now I've tried to uh, gel stain, which actually I like better, but that seems to be getting harder to find. And another color that I've used is walnut. Not the dark walnut, but the lighter walnut. But uh, some cabinets might require the dark walnut. Like I said, it depends on the color of the Bakelite. Now here I have taken Santa Wax to this, which also removes any of the excess. And it also helps to put oils back into the Bakelite. And as you can see, this looks like brand new. Looks like a brand new Bakelite cabinet now. Thanks for watching.